Well, holder Zimbabwe retained the Barth's trophy after outclassing host Kenya in a rain-drenched final at the Nyayo National Stadium. Zimbabwe showed their intentions early with a quick try at the corner that was converted for a 7-0 lead. In front of a sizable crowd at Nyayo, Zimbabwe again split open the Kenya defense with some crisp passing and quick feet to score the second try for a 14-0 lead inside the open opening of 15 minutes, well, Kenya regrouped and pulled a try back halfway through the first half. But it is Zimbabwe who scored the next try to silence the partisan crowd. The visitors led 21-7 at halftime. Then the skies opened in the second half, making the conditions very slippery. Zimbabwe adapted quickly and scored the final try at the death to win the match 28-7. It remains a fair contest so far. And that man, the danger man, Nyamunda, his partner in crime, Sigauke, he has jet shoes, goes past one, goes past the second, and this is Nyamunda. Nyamunda with the try line in sight. The Kenyans are grasping in the air. And Nyamunda scores the third try for Zimbabwe, 19-7 with the conversion to come. Being able to tick all the boxes, not doing anything out of the big end. I'm speaking. This is Dion Kumalo, breaks through several tackles, and now Sigauke is not going to be denied his double. Edward Sigauke, clearly, that is a try that will now hold. Absolutely nothing in the play. The Africa Bartes champions, the trophy being handed to Panache Zuse and the Junior Sables, the winners. Congratulations to the Junior Sables.